is there nothing sacred any longer? Nothing? So apparently in uh, Sturgis, Michigan, which is actually right down here, uh, a Amish family was shopping at a Walmart and had their horse and buggy stolen. Now, okay, I know what you're thinking. Uh, what, an Amish family shopping at Walmart? Yes, everyone shops at a Walmart now, even the Amish. But as they were shopping, a trucker said, hey, that girl is taking the horse and buggy. And so they contacted police and, uh, you know, they started looking around and they found the horse and buggy a few hours later at a motel not far away. Apparently, the police had had a run-in with the girl who stole the horse and buggy earlier in the day. I don't know why. But uh, she's been arrested on larceny and larceny of livestock pending the arraignment. And they have returned the horse and buggy to the Amish family. So all is good. But again, nothing is sacred. Nothing not even an Amish horse and buggy is sacred. <laughs> I can't even park it. I can't even hitch it up at the Walmart. Man, we live in some amazing times. Welcome. Welcome to Chewing the Fat. The entire podcast will be available later today to download. Thank you.